Good morning to you all. Welcome to the discussion on the topic projection of solids. Under this, we are discussing now axis inclined to one and parallel to another. Under this, we are solving a problem on hexagonal pyramid. What is the given problem? A hexagonal pyramid of base side 30 mm and axis length 60 mm is resting on HP on one of its base corner with its axis inclined to 35 degrees to the HP and parallel to VP. Draw its projections. Here, the hexagonal pyramid base side is 30 mm and axis length is 60 mm. And this base corner is on HP and its axis is making an angle 35 degrees to the HP. So we have to draw the projections. As a first step, what you have to do is we have to draw the XY line. After drawing the XY line, then draw a hexagon so that corner containing remaining two sides makes equal inclination with the XY line. So we have to draw the hexagon so that corner containing remaining two sides makes equal inclination with the XY line. Now we will draw corner and then hexagon. Say so this is the corner and this is the side and this is the another side. Complete the hexagon. Here, this side and this side makes equal inclination with the XY line. This side and this side. This is the corner. Corner containing remaining two sides makes equal inclination with the XY line. Length of the base side 30 mm. Length of the base side is 30 mm. Then this corner is on HP when pyramid axis making inclination with the HP. This corner is on uh, HP so that it image has to be in the reference line. Name all the corners as well as image of the axis in the top view. After that, draw the projectors from various points in the top view. Draw the projectors from various corners and axis point in the top view as shown in figure. With the given axis height, draw axis line. With the given axis height, draw axis line. The axis height is 60 mm. Here, F dash, E dash, D dash, C dash and this is the O dash. Join these points, say OF, OE, OD, OC. Then mark these points in front view. Here we have to mark these points. After that, we have to draw this front view in such a way that this axis is making an angle. 35 degrees to the XY line. So first to draw axis line is making an angle 35 degrees. Then to this axis line, draw base line which is perpendicular to the axis line. As it is making an angle 35 degrees to the HP, base line is making an angle 90 minus 35 degrees to the HP that is 55 degrees. So this angle is 55 degrees. So this line, the C is on XY line as this corner is on HP and this axis is making an angle 35 degrees means this base is making an angle 55 degrees. Then then complete the front view, second front view. See that this axis and this base are mutually perpendicular and point C is on XY line. Complete this second front view as shown in figure. After that, draw projectors from various points in the front view. Then draw projectors from the top view. After drawing the projectors from the front view as well as top view, locate the intersection points. 
Name those points. First, we'll draw all lines as light lines. Then we'll draw the face sides which are visible and base sides which are visible for the observer in the top view. So here, OE, OE, OA are visible. First, we have to draw all outside points as continuous lines and OE and OA are visible so that the base sides which comes behind these faces are invisible. Behind these faces are invisible. This is the required projection in top view when the axis is making an angle 35 degrees to the HP and the corner is on HP. Here the base length is 30 mm and axis height is 60 mm. That's about the projection of hexagonal pyramid when its corner is on the HP and the axis is making an angle 35 degrees to the HP. I hope you all understood well. Thank you.